Hey everybody, welcome back. And here we are with our sprint car segment of our 2023 virtual toy fair. Um, we're gonna talk about some of the 2022 cars that we still have, and then uh, talk about 2023 and what the roster, the lineup's looking like for that. So over here, we have uh, the Lance DeWeese 69K car up front. Great looking car. We have a few pieces of that left in stock. The same for the past blue ribbon PBR Lucas Wolf five car. Um, that's it has a great looking paint job on it. Then we got the uh, Outlaw Legends uh, series uh, that we do for uh, historical cars and taking those liveries and applying them to the new body styles. And this one's a tribute to Donnie Schatz's first 410 sprint win, um, the Schatz Crossroads truck stop. A couple of those are left, and then. Everybody knows the Casey Kane number nine car. Over here, uh, we have what we have Brian Brown's Casey's uh, store car taken apart so everybody can see the details and the fit and finish that we have on these. Top wing comes off, nose comes off, and the front wing comes off. Then a fully detailed Chevy 410 engine. Next to that, we have the number one of Logan Wagner. Um, Logan was great to work with this year. Um, great looking car. Zimco has been a name that's been around forever in sprint cars. Um, then behind him, we have the 41 Alba uh, of Jason Johnson Racing, uh, driven by Carson Macedo. Um, another great looking car. Got a few of those left in stock. And then finally right here, uh, Danny Dietrich's White Kurtz Livestock Sprint Car. Um, Really fun working with Danny too. Great guy. For 2023, um, we're still working out uh, a bunch of the artwork and uh, details with the teams, but we're gonna have a great lineup. Um, something brand new for this year is we made a 150th scale mold to replace the 164. Uh, these are a little bit bigger, a few more details, more room uh, to lay out the graphics and the decoration. Um, so, uh, as you all know, we have the Buddy Kofoid, uh, Indy Parts High Plains Building Edition, um, in 150th and 118th. Uh, these two here in the, uh, the next two are shots as number 15s, the Black Sage that was for the West Coast last year, and the white number 15 was the 22 Knoxville National available in both 118th and 150th. These are team exclusives, so you're gonna to need to get in touch with uh, the Shots team to get your orders for those. After that, we got the True Timber number five, uh, driven by Spencer Baston, uh, both coming in both 118th and 150th. Um, this was his Rookie of the Year car for 2022, and uh, we just closed out the PO on that one, so a few more pieces available for pre-order. Um, then we have the 118th, uh, excuse me, the 150th, uh, Giovanni, Giovanni Skelzi, um, Logan Aspen Air Sprint, and those are coming in both scales. That is a team exclusive as well, so get in touch with the team for that. In addition to that, we have, we already have signed up, uh, Donnie Shots for this uh, for 2023. Um, Danny Dietrich is, is going to sign up again, I'm pretty sure. Uh, we're talking to him. Uh, Brock Zierfoss with the Mooses LZ Bar and Lounge. Um, Anthony Macri, David Gravel, Casey Kane, Brad Sweet. Um, and then we're talking to a host of other teams as well. Uh, for 2023, these are going to be more limited edition releases. We're talking like 350 to 400, 500 pieces um, if it's not a team exclusive. Um, so we're going to call the number pretty close to the amount that we have pre-sold. Uh, for our Outlaw Legends series, we're going to have a couple more releases this year. Again, Outlaw Legends, that's where we take a historical livery, famous car, and apply it to the new, uh, the new body style. And a portion of each sale uh, we donate to the uh, foundation at the um, Sprint Car Hall of Fame in Knoxville, Iowa. Uh, one of the upcoming ones is going to be a 
tribute to Jeff Swindell's 104 octane boost uh, sprint car. This is one of the best looking sprint cars that ever ran on the track, in my opinion. Um, when GMP released this the first time decades ago, it was one of our best sellers. Um, great looking car. Uh, you know about the Bass Pro Danny Lasowski? Um, never been done in 118th before. Um, so that's available for pre order now. And then soon, will be the Viverin number 10 that uh, Dave Blaney drove. Uh, one of the most famous sprint cars from the 90s era um, and early 2000s when GMP was making these. Well, that's about it for the sprint car stuff. Uh, a lot of exciting things happening this year in, in this area of uh, diecast. And uh, stay tuned for more updates.